All right, so I've just looked at the countdown timer to the game. There's about seven minutes to go, so I should be able to squeeze in another review prior to the game, which is really good. So let's, let's get in, let's do it. Hey guys, welcome back, Beer Reviews with the Beer Sarge. Uh, yeah, so that uh, last uh, review that we just did on uh, the McLeod's uh, Blue Water Single Hop Unfiltered Pale Ale, because I got another one, I got this one as well. So this is another new one that I hadn't f known that it was, well, I, I realised that it had been released, but I hadn't been able to pick it up. I've never been able to find it. Um, obviously the um, distribution of these beers in my liquor land was you know it was down uh, and so I couldn't find it when it was first released but I managed to get this from Pack and Save. Good old Pack and Save. Uh, good people. Unfiltered IPA this is called and on the front there you've got like a, a bunch of kids. Can I say kids because well they probably are um, and it looks like they're under a Pudakawa tree on the piss. Ah, the fucking memories. Waipu Cove. Ah, the memories. Uh, well, maybe not all the memories. Maybe just some of them. Uh, anyway, this is a six and a half unfiltered IPA. Uh, what does it say on the side, you say? I hear you say. Uh, this IPA is for all the good folks out there, the ones who appreciate a good beer as much as all of us here at the brewery. To make this extra special for our beer loving friends, we jammed it with ridiculous amounts of Amarillo and Citra for explosive sun ripened citrus and tropical fruit on the nose and palate, underpinned by a lean malt base hinting of peach. <laughs> Smooth bitterness lends what well, leads to a rewarding finish, the most perfect end for beer loving friends everywhere. Um, peach, now that's interesting. Um, tropical fruits and citrus on the nose um, yeah oh, sounds delicious so oh, renouncing the team it's about to beat the Highlanders <laughs> interesting right let's get this in a glass so another unfiltered I mean I, I, I kind of wonder like does unfiltered um, does it cost less like, do you, I guess it would because you'd have less processing because it's unfiltered, so you're not gonna, you're not pulling anything out. You, there's no additional um, flocculants. <laughs> you see, no, I didn't. It was just a flocculant is actually a word. Flocculants. Well, I think that's how you say it. There's things like um, uh, gelatin. So gelatin is used, and there's also Irish moss. I think they use Irish moss, and that pulls all the particles out of the beer to the bottom um, gelatin obviously floats through picks up bits and pieces and then drops to the bottom that is what uh, uh, the guys who make uh, Piney the Elder use they use gelatin um, but this unfiltered like you're removing a step in the process or you're removing the your you're removing the you're fiddling around with the beer so it must cost less too and I think it makes it taste better. Um, although I do like a fucking very crisp West Coast IPA every now and then. Yes. But anyway, back to this one. So, good friends. No, good people. God damn it, you're an egg. Good people. Good people, unfiltered IPA. Um, oh, they, they look like a friendly bunch on the front of here. Anyway, team's running out. Time to get into this uh, review. Yeah, oh, tastes good. Very good. You should buy it. Oh my god, that fucking smell is brilliant. So the citra, it's not super prominent on the nose. Like it's not, it's not the blue, blue water one. Blue water? I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting. The blue water one was a lot more um, nasal forward. This is a great one. Oh. So it has a, an initial bitterness. Um, the, I, I don't get the peach, but I do get 
Yeah, I guess it is. Well, I guess it's peachish. I get a. I get a light flavored malt in there with the with the citrus and the like the fruitiness, which all told together with the nasalness and the yeah. This is another great beer from the clouds. I don't know why I waffle on so much. There you go. That's you. That's what you're looking for. Good people. Unfiltered IPA. It's a 6.5. You can't go wrong with it. You should fucking go out and buy it. Anyway, go the Chiefs. <laughs>